What's going on everybody? I know it's been a while for 3D printer check-in, but we're back and we'll uh, be checking in a little bit more often. Over here on the P1S, we have brackets for our spool holder here. I'm really liking how this is turning out. We're gonna add a couple more layers. This whole corner is gonna be uh, rearranged a little bit more. In addition to our spool bracket or spool holder here, we're making these and they're gonna be kind of like a shelving unit for here so we can uh, put our supplies and everything up on top. And that's what we have uh, that just finished here on the K1 Max. Let's get this off. There we go. Finally got the uh, K1 Max back up and running, had some issues. Get that off. And as you can see here, this shelving unit has these uh, square pegs in here. So we'll be able to make our own holder so we can put isopropyl alcohol on it or just some uh, activator, but we'll be able to make storage devices that will uh, fit in here. And that's gonna be fun. Um, I'll be doing a blender video on that and how you can make those yourself. Did have some issues with the K1 Max. It was fully one piece, didn't look like there was any issues this morning when I went to take this off the bed. And as soon as I did, um, yeah, not quite sure what happened there. Uh, I have been having some issues with the K1 Max. Again, we had an issue here where it just got jammed, but was able to save it, just measured the height, cut it, and boom, we finished this off. We got this file from STL Flix. Yes, uh, we're not to October yet, but Halloween is coming up. So gonna be working on a lot of those. That's gonna wrap it up for this 3D printer check-in. Y'all have a great day and remember, keep making stuff.